hello friends in this video we are going to learn about the basic formatting and uh, some basic functions for doing the formatting first we need to select the cell or range of the cells we can select using the mouse or the keyboard we have already discussed about it so I want to select these headings and want to format it. We can change the font by clicking over here. We can change and we can also increase the font size from here. We can do the alignment using this option. Left, center or the right. It is not fit. Double click over here. It will fit automatically depending on the size of the data you have entered select the numbers so here we have options for number we can convert the numbers into currency we have already discussed about it but when you click over here it will by default it will convert into the dollars but if you want more currencies then click over here come more formats more currencies select as per your requirement so I want to use the Indian rupees so I would like to select these ones we can also have some more formats in percentage and we can increase or decrease the number of decimal places it will decrease this is for the increment here we can change the number type number percentage scientific accounting financial so many options are there font and font size we have already discussed this is for the bold italic this is for the strike through this is for changing the text color and uh, i don't want this one and this is for the filling colors so we can fill the color in the particular or selected range of cells this is useful in highlighting the things we can also do the merging and now we can merge the cells select the cells you want to merge i want to put the heading over here i'm selecting four cells now click over here so you have merge all merge horizontally so i will merge all these and now i will insert the employee data and i would like to see middle of the cell and I would like to change the color and some background so now this is highlighting very well we can also give the borders to the data so I would like to select the data then come over here click on the border so in this selecting this option I can fill the all borders to the table we can also give the color to the borders by using this option and uh, we can also select type of border so we can increase the size of the border using this option and uh, we can also give the direction to the text select this one I'll move a little bit more I'll come over here and I will decrease the size the width of this cell now select this one come over here select so this will move like this so you need to adjust so these are the some options you you can try some formatting if you want to open a particular website or a particular place in the seat we can use the option of hyperlink insert any tag open sheet click over here insert select the cell come over here and now you can give the link of any website which you want to open we can also give a particular place which is available in this sheet so click over here salary data so I click over here apply ok and now it will move to the PL this sheet we can go back so using this option we can also give the comment click over here any comment 
if you have a lots of data and you want to give any comment so this is used for open p and l data comment over here so no one can see right now when we hover the mouse over here so we can see the particular comment so you can give the comment using this option we can delete by clicking over here edit delete and this will delete okay so these are the for formatting options now we can do the some basic formulas first i would like to remove all this formatting because i really don't like so i don't want this one now we will do some calculations come to the last cell over here i want to do the sum of the salary click over here we will options different functions available click over here so now i need to give the reference of the cells so i will select these ones and i will press enter it will do the sum for me and the total is coming over here we can also learn basic formulas in the next video do practice do some formatting and use these options create some good looking data or the tables for your learning thank you friends